Welcome to Buona Pappa. I'm Barbara and he's Luca. And today we are going to prepare a very yummy yum recipe that's Italian mac and cheese with carrots. I know that it will be surprising for you, but mac and cheese, it's not Italian. I mean, we don't know what's mac and cheese in Italy. But when I moved here, I discovered that that's a big recipe for babies and for kids and also for adults. So I just did mac and cheese with, with a touch of Italian taste. I already put our water to boil because we're going to prepare our pasta. And as it's called mac and cheese, you can use baby macs. And I found this baby penne uh, and it's a sure pasta. You can use any kind of pasta that you want. I suggest you to use the short shape and as it's a baby recipe, the small ones for babies. So our water is boiling. Let's add half a teaspoon of salt and two handful of pasta. And as Luca likes pasta, let's say three handful of pasta for Luca. Meanwhile, the pasta will need nine minutes to cook. We're going to prepare the sauce. Now, Luca, I need my other hand, so you're going to play. Mommy's going to prepare the sauce, and then you're coming back for the final result, okay? So, while our pasta is cooking, we're going to prepare our sauce in less than nine minutes. It's easy. So, we need a pan, turn on the heat at medium high, and what do we need? Two tablespoons of butter. I know, I know it's butter, but it's also mac and cheese, so... And we are going to melt the butter and when the butter will be melted we're going to add the other ingredients two tablespoons of flour and bleached flour two tablespoons of ricotta you can use the homemade fresh ricotta that we did last time or you can use any fresh ricotta that's fine two tablespoons of parmesan cheese one cup of milk and I use four tablespoons of Asiago cheese. Asiago cheese, it's a very mild and soft Italian cheese. Um, you can use also fontina if you want. The important thing, it's for your baby, so I prefer to use mild flavored cheese. So our butter is melted. We're going to add flour and we keep stirring. We keep stirring and then we are going to add the milk slowly because we want to form a nice cream keep stirring keep stirring and we will add the whole cup of milk and we will keep stirring and we do not want any grain to be formed so we keep stirring and with the wooden spoon, we keep destroying, disintegrating the grains. Oh, the other ingredients, carrots, because this is a carrot mac and cheese. Babies, they love mac and cheese, so why not adding some color and some veggie? I steam one carrot and I just chop the carrot in tiny, tiny, tiny pieces and I will add the steamed carrot at the end. It will eat color and your baby will love, you know, color, whatever is, you know, different and pops up. And also will give you the satisfaction of giving veggies to your baby. Our sauce is creamy, no grains. And when the milk and the sauce will start boiling, Public. It's time to turn off the heat and add the other cheeses. We're going to add the ricotta cheese. Mmm, it's already yummy. And the Asiago cheese. And that's, it's, it's grated, that's the other thing. The Asiago cheese and the Parmesan cheese, they are grated so they will melt easily. The timer says that our pasta is ready. I will turn off the heat for the pasta and the heat for the sauce is already off. So, wow, the pasta is ready. So, let's turn the pasta. Mm, nice. 
So we add a bowl, we have our pasta, let's add our pasta to the bowl, let's add our creamy sauce to the pasta and our orange nice colored carrots. Let's mix everything together. Luca will really, really, really love it. I'm going to take a bowl and I'm going to put the portion that I want to serve in this bowl. I'm going to put the Parmesan cheese on top and I will just put the cup in the toaster. Let's wait five minutes so that our carrot mac and cheese will have a nice crust on top and then it will be ready to eat them. And now I'm going to call Luca. I think he will be very happy about the final result. So our carrot mac and cheese came out from the toaster with a nice and crunchy top. The mac and cheese is ready to be um tested. What do you think? What do you think? It's good? It's good? Are you sure? Hmm? That was for mommy. Mm -hmm. That's good. And we had a carrot, so um, he's eating veggies and he's happy because they are colored and it's fun. So for today, from me and from Luca, it's everything. See you next time with another recipe from Buona Papa. And as always, um, Buona Papa tutti! Buona papa, that's good! Buona papa tutti! Yes, Luca! Yes, Luca! Um. <laughs>